Hello ladies and gentlemen and happy Wednesday. I am forecaster Liam McKenney and over the last three to four days it has been extremely active in the United States when talking about weather and that is all thanks to this massive weather maker that over the last several days brought multiple rounds of very strong to severe storms from portions of eastern Texas across Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama and now we're seeing it here right along the eastern coast as well. I know a lot of you have been hearing about our shot for severe weather here in South Carolina, and you can thank all this cloud cover for keeping us, I guess you could say, severe weather free, considering there hasn't been really that much lift and instability in the atmosphere for severe thunderstorms to form. And thankfully, that is a very good thing. As you're heading out the door tomorrow, uh, as you're heading out the door tomorrow, uh, showers likely across much of the area. We could see a couple of strong two severe storms, but our risk for severe weather is very, very low. But thankfully, those showers will be pretty much heading out of our area as you're heading towards your noon hour. Possibly a, a couple of very small showers throughout the day, but other than that, we're going to be rain free over the course of the day tomorrow. Temperatures staying in the mid 60s all throughout the day, and eventually the showers leave as you head into your Thursday night and into your Friday morning as well. So here's a look at your uh, as here's a look at our severe weather risk over the course of the night tonight. Thankfully, no hail, but unfortunately, we do have a very small risk of a couple of isolated damage, uh, damaging wind gusts and also a very small risk of a tornado as well. Beyond that, Thankfully, we're, we're going we're gonna to be getting a, uh, a pretty good amount of rain to wash out all the pollen that has been in our area over the last several weeks or so, possibly upwards of an inch or so right along the coastline, maybe up, to, maybe upwards of a half an inch right along the PD and also on the border belt. But the best shot of rain is going to be right here along the immediate coast as well. Beyond all this rain, a gorgeous forecast for your weekend, plenty of sunshine, temperatures all across the board staying in the mid 60s, going down into the low 40s right along the immediate coast back across the PD on the border belt, topping out in the high 30s as well. Here's a look at your 10 day forecast beyond our severe weather event over the course of the, of the night tonight. Absolutely picture perfect weather for this weekend and early start of next week. Temperatures starting out in the 60s for your weekend, warming eventually up into the 70s as you head into next Wednesday. Our next shot around will come with our next system that comes on Thursday. We could have another shot for some strong to severe storms, but obviously it is way too early to tell at this point in time. Across the PD and also on the border belt, once again, beyond tomorrow, absolutely gorgeous weather, plenty of, of sunshine, temperatures warming up almost to the 80s as you head into Wednesday with that next shot of rain coming next Thursday.